Hello and welcome to ET Garage. Today I'm at Carlisle Fall Swap Meet and I'm here in the car corral. Looking at some of the cars. And they got some pretty nice stuff here. It's, you know, prices are what you expect these days. I like this uh, 59 Chevy right here. This is nice. Not mo no details on it though, so I don't know if it's already been sold or not, but uh, it's not perfect, but it's pretty nice. And uh, this Cadillac is really nice though. But uh, I've been here a couple of hours already, and I've walked around all the uh, parts being sold. There's new parts, old parts, signs, apparel, and all the stuff that you usually see. I've been here, like I said, about two hours, and uh, I've seen about half of it. So far, I only bought these beef sticks, five for three dollars, so. I doubt I'll be spending much money. They do have some Corvette parts here. So, uh, no Corvette parts, they are here. Just not like you would see at Corvettes at Carlisle. When it's old Corvette vendors, basically. But, uh, I'm gonna go walk around some more. See what there is to see. Okay, I'm here up here on the stage by the grandstands and the uh, Antique Automobile Club members have a membership drive and uh, they got some of their cars here. They got this beautiful 51 Chevy Deluxe Convertible. Yeah, it's a nice car. Next one is another Chevy, a 1930. It's pretty nice. And this Cruiser. 61 Studebaker Cruiser. That's really nice. Let's go check out the interior on that. You don't get to see too many cruisers. Hopefully you guys can see the uh, reflection there. But over here is my favorite, the 67 Austin Billy. That is really nice. And then next to it is something I'm not familiar with at all. It's a 1930 Oakland. It has a V8 flathead in it. I can see that. And uh, pretty nice. But, uh, Let's see what else there is to see. I don't know how much more walking around I'm going to do here. I'm going to need to take a break soon. Let's see what kind of deals I can find. There's so all that that I haven't seen yet. I don't know if I'm going to see it all. But uh, let's get going. All right, I'm about ready to call it a day. Uh, did buy some stuff. I bought three cans of carb cleaner for 10 bucks, and I bought some socks. And one thing I like about these shows, you get to see these old, uh, these old intake, intake manifolds like the uh, Hillborn fuel injector and, and uh, the cross ram. And there's a uh, two, two four barrel one set up there. And uh, go over here. We got uh, it looks like another fuel injection. Yeah, another Hillborn fuel injection right there. And over here they got a couple of pedal cars. I think I'd buy that airplane one, but I won't fit in it, so forget that. Come on everybody, have a great day and God bless.